But a series of patients we now identified where these commonly used drugs actually affect how sperm work and how they're transported through the body. One of the things that's really striking about male infertility is how little is known about sperm problems and their contributions to infertility. For example, we often see men who have been treated with medications over a period of time, and the effects of those medications on fertility have never been sorted out. Take, for example, a class of drugs called antidepressant drugs, specifically the serotonin reuptake antagonists. These are drugs that are very commonly used throughout the United States. Well, it turns out that a small subset of men are very sensitive to these drugs. The drugs essentially stop sperm from going through a man's body. Now, these drugs have been used for tens of millions of men, but a series of patients we now identified where these commonly used drugs actually affect how sperm work and how they're transported through the body. And the effect can be so severe that it can take a man who has essentially normal production levels of sperm and result in him shooting blanks, no sperm whatsoever coming out. 